Nintendo. P. Penny. Present. Oh yes, let's do that. This is interesting, all right. Is it zero? Yeah. You can hear him. Because of my new headset, it might not be possible. No, I guess I should have uh, introduced myself. It's been Zor Action AR, and then welcome to, uh, Rewalk vs. Let's Play, kind of? Maybe just a gameplay video? Who knows? Uh, Star Fox Zero on the twine. And here we are. Oh, look, that's the mothership, which I don't know what the name is. Alright, this means you can do whatever. Yeah, as a natural shooter. Ah. Uh. 
fine. Yeah, I figured as much. Ah, oh, okay, you can do it. Uh, an implement by doing the opposite of what uh, someone saw this interesting. Information. The graphics are really nice. I did do an unboxing video of this game, which you can check out at the beginning of the playlist or in the uh, link in the description. Gotcha. Alright. And I suppose that's Falco. Yeah, I hope you, I hope you could hear him. Judging by the uh, judging by Dusty, you probably can. The sound files on Dusty. Star Fox Zero. Oh, I guess now I can do it. And welcome to Google Walkthroughs or gameplay, let's play video. Uh, I'm just blind. Here, here we are playing Star Fox Zero, the new Star Fox game came out. When did it come out? Uh, April 20, yeah, April 22nd, 2016. Now, what is Star Fox? Well, it's mainly a rail shooter, but as you can see, you can move around sometimes. Um, and, um, yeah, that's about all I know. I have played two Star Fox games. The Star Fox 64 on uh, the Wii. Played that a lot. Also played Star Fox Command on the DS, which is actually on the Wii U now. Um, but yeah, I just, you know, I was uh, wanting to check this out. Now this game, you know, the reviews it got, at least from Game Informer, are actually pretty bad. As in Game Informer, oh, as in Game Informer, as in Game Informer, uh, oh, let's watch this. I got Lombardi. The Behera. So we told. Fox for Cloud. Oh, 
Alright, and that actually showed off what the main difference between this and the earlier games are. Is the fact that you can actually transform, the Arvin can transform into a walker, and the Landmaster can transform into a, a well, a, attack, like, a bomber. Um, which is interesting, also what's interesting, as you probably could have tell from the intro, is all, most of the gameplay, I had my pro, my pro controllers up, uh, but most of the gameplay takes place on the gamepad with motion control, which is interesting. Really weird if you're not accustomed to using AR, you know, a, AR, Nintendo AR, with, like, DS, or 3DS, as well as, uh, well, the Wii U, you know, that, uh, AR, no, well, uh, VR, AR, something like that, it's a little bit of both. Um, not Oculus Rift and Vine AR and VR. But anyway, so, yeah. Uh, I've been meaning to play this since it first came out. I did I do an unboxing video of it, but I was just busy with other games and my mic exploding. Or my mic, my previous mic breaking that I couldn't, you know, uh, play it until now. So here we are. Oh. Alright, now I hope you can... I mean, judging by the fact that I'm actually seeing the... Uh, I'm actually seeing the sound off of the, uh... I'm actually seeing the sound off of the, um... Audacity that you probably can hear the gamepad. I don't... I'm not quite sure, but I think you can. Actually, I just want to end it here and see if you can hear it off the gamepad. Um... But yeah, the thing about my new mic, the... X Reflex Cloud 2 is the fact that it has a small problem when it comes to something like this, where it's a big help when it's not coming to something like this. But yeah, it kind of is really good noise canceling. So basically, if it's not me talking or no, or someone wearing the headset talking, well, you get the small problem if you can't hear it, which is bad for it, you no know, for split screen co-op, and it's bad for this. So um. Yeah, I'm just gonna... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna see if you can hear me first as, it, as we're coming up to 14 minutes anyway. We'll see if you can hear me first, and then we'll see if we go on. So this will be a gameplay video, I guess, uh, of Star Fox Zero. And maybe a Let's Play if you guys like it and want to see more. Uh, but like I was saying, yeah, it got... Which is hard to get, mind you. It got a 6.75 more or less on Game Informer. Game Informer never rates that low unless it really sucks. And most of the things that we're talking about is mainly it's very similar to the other Star Foxes. Uh, very similar to the 64 and similar to Star, you know, just similar to all the Star Foxes that came before it. But that still might be fine for me as I really haven't played those. And if if it has saving, uh, yeah, if it has saving. Uh, your progress in reloading when it comes to doing the missions, if it is like Star Fox 64, then uh, that's good enough for me, as well as the fact that you probably see the Landmaster more, which is cool, the tank, and, uh, yeah, the transforming things are fine, but, uh, yeah, so we'll see. Uh, but yeah, Star Fox is also one of those weirder games, uh, as you, as you saw, it has animal characters, more or less, but it's cool, it could not be aliens, who knows. Uh, so yeah, I want to say that... Yeah, I think you're just in my channel. Uh, I guess my channel is more mature, I want to say. Uh, but we'll see. Uh, Alright, so um, that'll be it for this video, I suppose. It's been a short one, yeah, but I got a couple games lined up for today anyway. Oh, we still might do another one. Anyway, continue this if we want. If uh, uh, if A, if A you can hear it, and B, if you guys like it. Yeah, also, uh, Star Fox Zero, uh, mentioning when we make the launch day. Uh, Day one edition had both Star Fox Zero and Star Fox Ground. Star Fox Ground is in our what would be considered an arcade game if it was on the Xbox, but no, it's a $14 game. Uh, which I'm not quite sure what it is, to be honest. I'll have to check that out, but uh, I came out with it, and it, actually, the day one edition had them both. And the interesting thing about the day one edition, if you uh, haven't watched my boxing video, which you can't watch in the boxing video, you see what it is, is the fact that it has two game cases in it. The Star Fox Zero game case and the Star Fox God Guard game case, uh, which is interesting. Uh, and it might not be just the one edition; it might just be the physical edition that has that. Um, because, well, it is also available, like all the Wii U games, it's also available on the Wii U store. However, the Star Fox you can you can get Star Fox Guard simply from Star Fox Zero, Star Fox Zero is like 999 US, and Star Fox God is like 14.99 US, I 
don't quite remember, but something like that. And if you get one or the other, you get, get if you get one, you get a four dollar coupon to the other. Uh, so that's interesting. Um, but anyway, so we yeah, like I said, that'd be it for this video part. That's a let's play. It could be a let's play, yeah, if it's like the old Star Foxes, where basically it's endless, you know, endless fruits and stuff like that. No, we'll see. This is definitely a gameplay video, just see if it works. Alright, the game works fine, by the way. The game, the game feels fine. Um, you know, the game looks nice, the game sounds nice. It is Star Fox. Um, the question is how much change has occurred to it, but yeah. Oh, and also, I see that emblem. Uh, you see, well, the character and the emblem to the right. Uh, that's actually something that the developers thought of is developers. I mean, I can't remember the Nintendo's name before uh, the, the first one. Um, my bad. Uh, Mimoto? Yes, Mr. Mimoto. Uh, uh, it's either him or it's the From, Sto from Software developer. I forget. Um, actually, why well, can't I, I can just look it up right here, couldn't I? Yeah, Miyamoto got it right. Alright, so yeah, basically Miyamoto thought it would be cool to have the Japanese character for Zero, um, as well as have a fox tail around it like that, just to make it interesting, and then he called the game that Star Fox Zero, which is interesting. Alright, but anyway, yeah, like I said, that'd be it for this video. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate you guys watching on this video. That's me. Also, I'll see you in the comments. If you want to make a series of this, um, if everything does check out, I will still upload it if everything does not check out. Just to say, okay, this how this how it came out. I can I cannot record because of this. Um, so yeah, but we'll see. All right, but anyway, so yeah, that'd be it for this video. Also, appreciate the final play Star Fox Zero in general. Most of this team, it's to me that's going to be the drill tip. And, uh, yeah, I'm not used to doing an outro for a video this short. Yeah, sure, I have videos this short uh, going up on my channel all the time, but I'm not doing an outro for them. Uh, it's very weird for me. I, I, I prep myself for doing 30, 30 minute long outros. Um, no, doing an outro at 30 minutes usually is what I do these days. All right, but anyway, so, yep, that'd be it for this video. And I guess, see you in the screen.